right, so I'm going to go over how to use the Anchored View app for Sierra Charts. Start out with uh, settings. So this is the Anchored View app settings. You can choose the input data and then whether to include um, up to two bands. And you can add up to 12 um, VWAPs to a chart. And I'm going to show how that's done. So it's really simple once it's on there. You can go to any bar. Let's say we want to VWAP from here to anchor a VWAP from here to the end of the chart. And this is a daily chart. So basically, I select the bar, I right click, and I do anchor VWAP here. And I go like that, and then the VWAP appears, right? I can then go and remove it. So now it disappears. I can add it back. I can go up here, add another one. So now I have two. I can add one from here. I have three. Yep. I have three. And then I can remove them, right? So I, let's say I want to remove this one. I put my cursor over it. I do remove this VWAP. I can also do remove the last one, which remove that one. And then I have an option also to remove all of them, right? So it clears out the whole chart. Let's see what this looks like when I have the bands. If I, let's say, enable a single band in this case, which is one standard deviation, and plot the VWAP on the chart, then I get the VWAP plus a one standard deviation band around it. And if I do it up here, I'll have that as well for the second one. And I can always come into this and remove it. And then we have just back to a single one. Anything else that you want to do, you can always go and modify these subgraphs um, to whatever colors and shades and stuff that, that you want to. But that's, that's the gist of it.